Hello everyone and welcome to episode 25 of Minecraft Vanilla Super Flat Survival. And I have actually found some villagers to trade with like I showed you in the previous episode and I did trade with many villagers there. I maxed out the trade with the first villager who offered 19 wheat for uh, one emerald and uh, the, the second farmer that offered 20 wheat for one emerald. And I maxed out all of them, and I did not have time to reset the trade to get more emeralds, because by the time that I did that, the sun was about yay high in the sky, and I knew that I was two villagers away, and I did, did not want to risk a zombie siege happening on the village, so I drank the last of my potions and ran back here. And as you can see, I managed to get 14 emeralds, so that's quite a lot. That's much more than I ever had, and I have seven em emeralds in the chest right here for some of my previous trading, and now we have 27, emer uh, um, 27 emeralds, and surprisingly we are able to make two emerald blocks, so th this is all of um, our efforts coming to fruition. We spent so much hay and so much wheat to get these emerald blocks. And as you can see, of course, I made sure to check that I have an iron pickaxe on hand from that loot chest when I looted um, a blacksmith's chest way back when. Uh, because uh, the emerald blocks can only be mined by iron pickaxes. So. And then I'm going to take this, um, these emeralds and trade with more villagers. So. Oh wow, looks like we're almost completely ran out of... Uh, our speed potion, so we gotta manufacture some more of those. Um, so to get that, we need these ingredients. We need a nether wart, a sugar, and a glowstone dust. And then I'm just gonna place this back right here. Uh, and then I'm just gonna go around and just do some just general chores around my base and stuff like that. Now, I was thinking what I'm gonna do in this episode and I came to the conclusion that I actually have to uh, build I'm going to build a rapid boat transit system from here to the area where I'm going to build my um, where I'm going to build my villager breeder and the reason for that is because I'm thinking well why should I run back and forth so much times when and when I'm gonna build a rapid transit boat system anyway so I might as well build one right now while I uh, because that way I'm not gonna I'm still gonna need to build one it's gonna save me time actually because I'm gonna Otherwise, I'm going to be spending the time to build a rapid boat transit system when I'm finished with the breeder. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to build the rapid boat transit system and then after that um, have the breeder done. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, and to do that, I'm going to use all of my uh, available, a bunch of, let me just pop that sugar in there real quick. I'm going to use all my available cobblestone walls. I'm going to craft much more. I'm also going to use all of the wood to make uh, all of those um, wooden pressure plates required to create such a boat trans system. Uh, hopefully the next time that I'm going to film it's going to be already completed. In addition to that I'm also going to be trading more with other villagers. Hopefully I might run to that to the closest village after that village over there. I'm also going to run around just trading with some more villagers. Uh, I'm going to make some more wheat. Uh, I'm hopefully going to get some glass eventually from a librarian villager and it's been quite inefficient because all the librarians that I've currently met have only wanted to buy paper and obviously I don't have paper in this world since I don't have sugarcane and there's no way that I can trade with them. So I can either find a villager that can trade books and then I can sell him the books but that would be quite inefficient because I uh, I really need these books, although, I don't know, I do need these books for enchantment, so, I don't know how that's going to go out, so, I'm also going to craft some bookshelves, oh, also a great trade that some librarians have is they buy, um, I can sell them three or so emeralds for, like, one bookshelf, or one emerald for one bookshelf, or something like that, so, this was mostly an update episode. This is quite a short episode, but uh, that's when, what that's exactly what I'm going to be doing uh, over the course of my off-camera work. 
so thank you very much for watching. This is Mine Kralix. Uh, see you all in the next video. It's going to be quite a while before I film the next episode, but I'm going to be doing a lot of uh, tedious and uh, long work, but uh, that's what I like Minecraft for, challenges and uh, building stuff. So thank you for watching. This is Mine Kralix, and see you all in the next video.